Hey there, this is Marin, Head of Customer Education here at Quip. Today I want to share with you in a very short video how I start my day in Quip, and hopefully you'll learn a thing of two so you can better start your day in Quip. Today I want to quickly cover notifications, tasks, chat, and updates. Now the first thing I do when I log into Quip in the morning is check my notifications. You'll notice that there's a red dot here if there are any notifications assigned to you. When I click on notifications, I'll see the last two notifications just recently came in. They're highlighted in blue, indicating that they're new and I have not yet viewed them. This is a great place for me to start because I get a really quick overview of everything that I'm accountable for within Quip. They can be as simple as just simply reviewing a document, someone has liked a message on a document that I'm in, or someone's responded to a comment that I've made within a document. Now the next thing I do is I check my tasks. Tasks are located on the left hand side panel as well. My tasks are anything that have been specifically assigned to me by another user. Now, I request from my teams that anyone assign a task to me if they need my input, especially by a certain date. For example, if you need my approval on a project plan, please assign me a task and set the date. That way, they'll show up on the taskbar here on the left-hand side panel so I can easily access them no matter the document, no matter the folder it's in, and no matter who it's from. I also create task lists for myself every Monday and Friday. I make sure that anything I need to take care of, I can keep on a list so it'll remind me as we get closer to the due date. No more post-its for me. I keep all of my tasks within Quip. I can link to other documents, set deadlines for myself, and make sure that I handle those tasks on time. The next thing I do is to check my chats. This is just a quick way to see if there are any unread messages waiting for you when you log into Quip in the morning. Now, sometimes if I have a little extra time here or there, I'll jump into the updates folder, the first option on the left-hand side panel. The updates folder is not what you've been specifically called out for in a document. This will just be a list of all of the documents that are shared with you, so you can easily stay on top of the things that are happening within your business. Personally, I find these less urgent, and this is just a great place for me to check in once a couple times a day, depending on my schedule, so I can stay on top of all the events that are happening. Consider this your lowest priority when you're logging in in the morning. This can be quite overwhelming, so I definitely recommend starting with those notifications, the tasks, the chat options as well. Now those are just my quick tips for how, what I do when I log into Quip every day. So try it out for yourself. Create a checklist, check out your notifications, and check out your chats first thing in the morning and see if that makes your day any more productive.